So you, you run quite a concentrated portfolio. Uh, you have, what, 20, 30 names or so? Uh, and that goes from very large companies to mid-caps and presumably some smaller uh, companies. Uh, for What is the percentage of your names where you have uh, a direct relationship with the management? And how do you feel about the necessity or otherwise to, to have that? Yeah, so we basically don't talk to management. We, uh, we used to, I used to years ago, uh, and stopped many years ago. Uh, and this is not a prescription for every investor or every fund manager. Uh, I have found over the years that I am most CEOs, especially, are good sales people. And they will sell you and whatever idea that they want to sell you. And they did not get there by being, some of them are uncharismatic, but usually they're charismatic, they're good salespeople, and they will positively bias you more times than not. Uh, and I found that on average, I've noticed whenever I've met a management team in the past, I got way more positively biased than, than I was otherwise. Uh, but more importantly, I got more overconfident about what I thought I knew. Uh, having that direct connection made me think like I, I knew more than reality. Uh, and it was a very, very rare cases that I actually got anything of value from that interaction. And so I stopped talking to management. I stopped meeting management. Uh, we have a rule now that we can contact the company, but we do it in under th with three conditions. One, we do it in writing. Uh, so we don't want to talk to them over the phone. We don't want to meet them. Uh, we ask specific questions, uh, and we only do that after having done all the homework that we're comfortable doing uh, and trying to find all the answers that we can prior to that. So we can then go and send them questions in writing uh, saying, I don't know, what's the number of stores that you have? Or something very specific. Uh, and we don't ask open-ended questions. So it's not for everyone. It's, we probably lose some things on the upside uh, because of that behavior. But I, I found, at least for us, for me specifically, that it just introduces way too much unnecessary bias into the process. Perhaps I could tell a quick story on that. Sure. Uh, I was uh, at my last firm. I was working actually not far from here. And <clears throat> there was a company that we were looking to short uh, actually, I don't know if any of you have heard of Quindell. Uh, it's about three bill market cap. I knew for a fact this was a fraud. I mean, one of the worst frauds. And you know, if you're talking about wanting to see someone in prison, Rob Terry should be locked up. Um, it was an absolute class A fraud. I knew it. We had him come in. First thing uh, you know, he does is he wall crosses us. So we're inside. We can't trade his stock. So, uh, yeah, that was 90% uh, profit on a short that we couldn't make. But then, the guy was good. I mean, really good. He was doing this whole Darren Brown mind trick thing. Uh, I mean, uh, no, no, I could see it. Uh, and I came away out of that meeting thinking, well, maybe I'm wrong, maybe, uh, maybe we could buy it, or maybe just a six-month trade, or... Hang on, what am I doing? I know this is a fraud. No, he was that good. So what am I going to benefit from meeting a manager? Well, if they tell me anything that's actually really interesting, I'm going to be inside. And if not, I'm risking, you know, maybe not quite a Rob Terry, but if they're half as good, you're going to be biased in the wrong way. So just, yeah, not worth it for me. Yeah, I, I think you can learn. I'm not saying managements, don't get me wrong, I'm not saying managements don't matter. They matter a lot. I mean, when we talked earlier about Nordstrom, uh, a lot of it was basically management, especially 10 years ago, uh, before we saw the results of what they said they're going to do. 
Uh, but we, I think we decided that we prefer to see it through their actions as opposed to their verbal interactions with us. Uh, like I said, it's not for everyone. It's what we found works for us. 